Hi, this is Renee at Macworld iWorld 2014. I'm talking to Paul Kafasis from Rogue Amoeba. Paul, what are you showing off that's new at the show? Uh, so at the show, in terms of what's new for us is Fission 2. Uh, it's our audio editor, so we've got a new version of that that came out uh, not too recently, but it's the newest thing that we're showing off here. All right, so you've had a history of making things easy for podcasters, for recorders, for people who want to grab their audio, but the platforms keep changing. There's Skype, there's FaceTime, there's Google Hangouts. How does that affect your products, and what kind of a timeline is that for you? Well, so Audio Hijack Pro is, a, is our tool for recording any audio, and podcasters have used it to record Skype conversations, and now, like you're saying, people are switching to FaceTime or Google Hangouts. Uh, fortunately for us, the product records just about any audio right on your Mac, so it's something that if you switch applications, the audio can still be recorded very easily. So for us, it's great. It doesn't really matter if, uh, if you say, you know what, Hangouts work better for us. Uh, you can still record that with Audio Hijack, so it's been, uh, it hasn't really affected us as far as uh, causing us extra work, which is good. So one issue that has persisted is your products are great on the Mac, but you don't have the capability to do it on iOS yet. Apple will not open that up for you. Do you think that'll ever change? It's been seven years, but there is new management. Is there hope? There's always hope, right? But uh, like you said, it's been seven years, and this is a, a platform that's grown hugely for Apple, and they haven't really felt a need to open it up very much. So on the Mac side, we're pretty happy with where we are, and on iOS, we can hope that we'll be able to do that in the future. This is Renee with Macworld iWorld. For more great videos, keep it locked to Macworld and iMore.